Hi, welcome in to Sage Centered Healing Tarot. Thanks for tuning in. I hope that all is well with you. We're about to take a general look at love messages for zodiac sign Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So welcome in. Thanks for being here. Thanks for your show of support by liking this video, commenting, and of course subscribing to the channel. It's abundantly appreciated. Let us, yeah, let us dive into the message. Remember to listen well, beautiful soul. Take the messages that are for you. Leave the messages that are not for you. And of course, apply your own discernment. So your first card is the Six of Swords. Um, this is a confirmation. I hear that someone true is showing up. And I was hearing this song, Twin, this, like, where have you been? So, so there's a twin flame energy with this ten of diamonds on the bottom of the deck. I hear father that is looking for you. So this could also be your father. I hear briar, bride, bursar, something like that. So someone is showing up. This person could be a Capricorn. I hear invigilator or investigator. This person is watching you, Cancer, that is showing up. They want to see you. They want to speak to you. This person is feeling like they are missing you. Destiny card. This person is missing you. This person is also in a hurry to see you, to speak to you. But this person is in a hurry because I, I, maybe like they don't want to waste any time or something like that. Yeah, this person has got to see you. So this person is coming through. This is a mystery person or this is something that you did not expect. This complacency card is saying this is something that should have been happening a long time ago. This should have been happening. For some of you, this is a person from your past that has been waiting for this new beginning with you. And this person, they have been holding back because they feel like now is the right time. And um, to see if you will accept them now, maybe they are free and this person now feels like it is the right time to be with you, to express love to you. They could be separating from someone with that six of swords or they feel like you are now free and you are ready to love them. Yeah, this person, um, the waiting is over. For some of you, this is a wedding, marriage. All right, this person really has something to speak to you, service card. Yeah, six of diamonds is a second confirmation. I hear total or totaled that you are this person's dream come true. I feel like saying, and this person wants to do right by you. I feel like this person is, this is like a wedding ceremony. This person is saying that they, like a vow, um, they've never, they could have never, 33, 333, they could have never asked for a better person or a better connection than you. So this person is taking this time to release, to express their feelings for you, feelings that they've been carrying for so long. This person has made their mind up to come see you. And um, this person could even cry. This person is feeling sorry too. This is like a, a, like a someone doing vows on a wedding day. Yeah, this person, someone is really in love with you. This is the ace of wands. This is what they want to show you. That someone is choosing you. This person is saying that they are your twin flame. This could be someone that is online watching you. This person for sure wants to show up and be a part of your life. This person is sorry. Yeah, this person is saying that they didn't know better than that sub song or something. All right, now they want they they are choosing you. They're in a better position to be with you. This person wants you to know that they really care about you for real, tr for true. Okay, they want you to know that they think about you. That they never leave you alone. This person wants you to answer their call. And they, they are like sorry about certain insecurities or the way they left things incomplete. The way they left things may have made you feel like they didn't care. Impartiality card. But this person, I don't know, they ran away from something. They're sorry. Yeah, the tower card. Oh my. This someone is someone who wants to be back, come back in your life is the energy I'm getting. Tower energy. Like someone is miserable without you. They're sad and they're sorry that they left you. They're regretful. Someone did something really 
it's bad and they regret it with this tower card cancer and they are feeling miserable without you but if this person they're having some type of a breakdown it's because they really love you they ha they can't hold their feelings back anymore this person will do anything to be with you they will commit to you the tower card is them is like a confession of feelings this person has been knowing how they feel for you for a long time in real life you make this you've always made this person feel good they always like you like all your, your shape like all your walk how you talk or you look exuberance this person wants healing with you and forgiveness and they want to be a part of your life forgiveness um this may be someone you were with or a new person or like a person that's been around in your life that has never really expressed themselves to you they're thinking of taking a chance and expressing to you how they feel with this guilt card they're tired of holding back they're tired of holding on to how they feel hiding how they feel and pretending if this person they they've like watched you be with other people or something like this but and they've always been around acting as if it was okay but they do want to be with you and they're this person even wants to marry you they like the way you think they like the type of person you are this person is feeling like they could have never asked for a better person a better version of you they feel like you are their twin flame you're their reflection their north star their dream come true this person wants to marry you they have a proposal miracle this person feel like you're a blessing and they've never had something be like you before right I, I said that about three times again there's no one like you with this rejection card in the reverse this person has never felt this way before with anything or anyone that they want to come back to you or come be with you this person loves you they they have leveled up you've leveled up this person know that you um are into healing leveling up transcending this person wants to be with you work with you in a relationship maybe in their past relationships they chose vanity for some of you this is a parent a mother a father in a past to them them in a past relationship this person may have felt like when they were loving like getting into relationships they chose vanity all right this could be a, a parental figure as well a mother or a father yes yeah, some parental figure with this grief card someone is feeling remorseful they're sorry about letting you go they felt some type of loss they feel distraught without you know this person wants to come make up to you They've been holding on, holding on, holding on, but they somehow this person is still feeling, wondering if you may be letting go or if you're not definitely interested or com com committed like they are. So they, they want to be with you. They think about you the same way they've always felt for you, perfection. But this person is wondering if the feelings are mutual. They really want to give it a chance though. But I do feel like someone is on the brink of giving up, walking away, but they still love you. All right. So yeah, isolation. Someone may be thinking of going back in isolation or someone is coming out of isolation. Someone is actually been in isolation, been in this waiting room energy, but they're tired. This person is fed up. So they want to take action. Um, gossip. Okay. Yeah, something about stagnancy with this hangman card or waiting or delays or setbacks. Maybe you told this person to wait. Maybe someone told you to wait. Maybe you weren't giving this person much to work with. But this person has been... This person is mesmerized by you. Charmed. Um, serenaded or something. They're already captivated. And this person, they do not want to let you go. I hear rose. I hear true enlightenment. Enlightenment and discovery. You're going to be seeing the truth of this person. Like never you've seen this person realer. Or maybe you have you have not been realer. This, is, this person could be showing up physically. All right. And someone could also be leaving. Someone could be saying, bid you, bidding someone goodbye because they're leaving and like an essence, a spiritual essence of this person is showing up to tell you before they transcend or leave that they're leaving and they love you so and they're sorry. 
soulmate twin flame energy someone new is for sure coming into your life after you letting go off of someone old two of cups in real life mm -hmm. yeah after that tower card that separation a new love is coming yeah where you're gonna feel expansion growth blessings gratitude well-being pros positivity prosperity like your prayers are being answered this will be the a person of your dreams your dreams that is being manifested into your reality and it is what is meant to be you're going to be feeling very happy two of cups is a soulmate energy you may have had karmic people like or karmic energies or negative energies in some way disturbances distractions past exes and family members and you know that kind of drama and disturbance of this five of wands card right but i feel like you feel higher than this now like you feel like you can handle whatever is coming at you you're not afraid anymore and i feel like you're not alone anymore also because you're speaking some truth and you're, you're gonna be mating with this new person balance Right, this is something that you've long been holding off for, waiting for, that is manifesting now. Yeah, the Empress. This is your true love, your dream come true. The Empress, Emperor energy coming out here on this table for you, beautiful soul. Yeah, you are definitely a shaman, a healer, about your mysticism. Someone loves your mystical powers, your shamanic abilities. They love your lifestyle. They love your beauty. They love your home, your your energy, the way you think, your feminine energies, your masculine energies, your creator energies. This person is watching you. They're love. They're in love with you, and they're really just taken, taken by you. All right, that's the energy I'm getting. Your Queen of Wands is your beauty, your radiance, your attractive, your outstanding. There is no one really like you. And this person wants to let you know that every time in the, in real life. They want to let you know every time you're the em their emperor, empress. Um, they may also feel like you're not very settled and this person is choosing you. This person sees that you're maybe free, single, disengaged or whatever. And they're coming to be a part of your life. I'm telling you, someone, you this is unexpected. And this person is coming to like take your hands while you are upset or nervous or single and to commit to you this is how i'm feeling and it's it's beautiful it's patient it's kind it's loving it's true this same person that's been waiting for you so long watching you so we have um pisces energy taurus energy aries energies on the table maybe some earth some fire all right yep expansion this is what this person is approaching you with they f they are trusting in their higher wisdom to move toward you i just keep feeling like this person has never found someone better or had someone better than you like you are their fulfillment their their life everything eight of swords is your last card to how this person is thinking about you this person has also stopped speaking with karmic people past people they've stopped entertaining 14 14 like they've stopped talking to or entertaining indulging something like this past people that are not up to up to par with you because this person wants to put all of their energy into loving you being with you growing with you because they feel cancer like you are a blessing in their life all right so let's get real all right so take it easy and I'll catch you in the next one. Remember to like this video, beautiful soul. Share the messages with those you love. Subscribe to the channel for more messages like this one. And I'll catch you next time. So all is well and all is within you. Take care. Love you.